everybody, it's me, Lucky Lance. Come back, Ash. I know it's been a little while. Uh, I am Lucky Lance, of course, leader of Last Best Hope on this channel. You will find me opening Yu Gi Oh! product, talking nonsense, you know, doing what I do, giving me my insight into uh, the wild and woolly world of Yu Gi Oh! I always wonder if I got something stuck in my beard or mustache. I'm always like prodding at it, you know, and it gives me chap lips. Anyways. It's been a little while, let me tell you why it's been a little while. First off, let's get into the action right now, if you know what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, that's a big one too, that's a 24 ounce beer. I'm doubling up, if you know what I'm saying. Classic Rainier can. I'm always so proud when I see people around in my factory wearing Rainier hats. I need to get myself one. I just like this here beer hat. Anyways, so the reason why this video is coming a little late is that one, Savage Strike, the newest set, which I'm going to be opening for you. In fact, I'm going to be opening a lot of it for you. It was delayed at my locals because of the extreme cold in uh, the Midwest. For whatever reason, they couldn't get it to us, so I had to wait till after YCS Chicago, which I did attend. I did go to YCS Chicago. The main event I went six and three, which of course you got to go seven and two to make day two. Just playing regular old Thunder Dragons, no dangers or nothing. Still went six and three, pretty good. Only lost to two Sky Strikers and a Burning Abyss. Which in those games I just I didn't open up well. I never got uh, anything going. <laughs> Anyways. Um, so on Sunday, I entered the uh, side events. I always play the regional qualifiers. I've already qualified to play at Nats. But, you know, I like playing the regional qualifier. I think that's the most tough one to win. you got to go 4-0 to win the thing. And you're playing as people that are desperately, a lot of times, trying to get an invite. Uh, and I got destroyed the first one. The first one I joined, I bricked super bad with Thunder Dragons. Like, the worst you could possibly brick. But then the second one came around, and, uh, well, guys, I won it. I went 4-0, of course, and there it is. There's the new map. Um, am I holding it up right? Yeah. Um, but, yeah, there it is. Uh, this fantastical Dragon Phantom Aze, or whatever his name is. This is a really good card. It's actually my favorite card out of the new set. And here is the deck box. Still in its shrink wrap, which I'm not sure if I'll ever take it out because I don't really need another deck box, even though I probably should. Uh, really nice color. It's a fuchsia color, which I don't know if I've ever seen this one before. But uh, it's only the second time I ever won a deck box. Uh, my original one I won back in 2012 was getting a little beat up because I've, I've used it mainly to transport cards back and forth from my house to my locals. And But it was forest green, which happens to be my favorite color, so I really cherished it. Plus, you know, getting top four was quite the event at my, my Seattle Regional. I did it with Dark Worlds. Uh, so anyways, YCS Chicago was great. I uh, had a really good time there. I almost died in a tunnel getting there, like a walkway. Like, it was like really cold when I first got there. And then this tunnel from the hotel I was at to the convention center, which was like a quarter mile walk, it was like 105 plus degrees in that tunnel. And that's a long ways to walk in that kind of temperature. Like It's just brutal. There's no shade or nothing. It's just hot air being blasted on you. But anyways, so I got back from my sister Chicago, and I still had a couple days of delays to get these Savage Strike boxes. They didn't come till Monday, the day after YCS Chicago concluded, and I couldn't get down until today to get to them because of massive snowstorm out here in Ravensdale. I live east, southeast of uh, Seattle, as many of you know, out here in Ravensdale, a friendly hospital, or whatever, host, I don't know the right word, but it's a friendly, humble place. We got dumped by snow, and it's still really treacherous conditions for us. Everyone drives around freely like all the roads are clear until you come to where I live and then it's like Jesus Christ there's still like two inches of ice on all the roads and it's going to be real scary because we're supposed to get like another foot of snow in a couple days so pray for Ravensdale I guess so that's the delay so to make up for the delay I'm going to do something on this, on this channel and I'm going to open up not one not two 
but three damn boxes to Savage Strike. Yeah, it's going to be a long video. That's why I got the big beer out. I got, I got the 24 ounce. I should have got the 32 ounce Miller. I really like the 32 ounce Miller. That's a big boy there. That's almost three beers. Uh, but anyways, yeah. I'm going to open up uh, three of them for you all. Hope you all, if you're a, a child, a minor, you got like a two liter bottle of Mountain Dew prepped. Um, I don't know why Pepsi, I've always been kind of disappointed. I've been waiting for the day where I see the one gallon jug of Dew. I'd be so in it. I'd be like, oh my God, a gallon? Uh, I'd be like 400 pounds, guarantee. But anyways, um, what I want to get out of Savage Strike, obviously the most expensive card is Fantastical Dragon, Phantom Aze, and Pot of uh, Exquisitiveness, I think it's called over here. It was over there as Pot of Indulgence. Um, those are the most expensive cards. I actually already own those. I had to buy those as singles either at my locals or at Wise to Chicago. But other cards I'd really like to pull are the new Trickstar cards. I really love Trickstar, so I want to get their new um, Carol Bane or whatever. I'm so glad we're finally getting that. It's well overdue. And I would also really like to get Live Stage, the uh, secret rare uh, <laughs> field spell. I would really enjoy getting that. And, uh, oh, and the Danger Ogopogo. I really want to get that, too. That'd be really great for me to get. And, uh, you know, I really like the Danger cards. That's sad it's the only Danger card we're getting, but, man, the Danger's really taking over the meta. So, anyways, guys, get ready. This is going to be a long video. That's three damn boxes. That's uh, 72 packs. Weird, you could open up a pack an hour. Just realize that. There's 24 packs in a box. You could have a little fun little game. Like every hour you open up a pack. Like you wake up on the dot. Like just ruin your sleep schedule. Just be tired as hell every day. Just open up a pack on the dot. Can you imagine doing that to yourself? Good God almighty. That'd be rough. Alright guys. So I don't have a sponsor because of all this snow. I couldn't get to anybody. But I hope everyone's doing alright. I think Dr. Dog Dude's doing just fine. He's still getting donations to help heal uh, the dog. The hurt dog. Now as we call him. Old hurt dog's doing alright. But you know we don't got any time to waste. We got to get moving in this video. Uh, so I'm going to try and pick up the pace and get right to it. So we're going to head over yonder. And I'm going to open up these boxes. Plural. Multiple boxes and you know how to stay warm when it's real cold it was like 15 degrees this morning i went to work 15 that's really cold out here in washington state so you know how you stay warm of course well you snuggle up with your sweetheart but i'm also talking about getting drunk ah let's get in your box number one of savage strike what's it say on here synchro synergy yeah because it's got Savage Borlo Dragon on it. Yeah, this set's supposed to revive Synchros, and it does. Cause there's just straight up, there's just Shiranui and the Psychic Monsters. Um, there's TGs in here too. I don't remember if they have a Synchro Monster. Um, yeah, man, that stuff was on there tight, tight like a toy girl. But yeah, I mean the next set, Dark Neo Storm is going to focus on XYZ, I guess. So that's going to be pretty sick. I love XYZ summoning. It was so cool when it came out. All right, here we go. Savage Strike. I have not opened a box yet, and it's been almost a week since this set's been legal. All right. Oh, here's Time Thief. Huh. Sure, anyway, Swordmaster, Bezel Ship, Orchestrated Release, Neos Fusion, and Lapis Dragon. Uh, we got... Hang on here. We got Squire Saga, Cybers Wicked, and Time Thief Regulator. I'm excited to see what these Time Thieves do. They seem pretty good. I especially like their uh, Time Thief Redoer. I think that card's really cool. Um, just snatch cards off the top of your opponent's deck. That's pretty cool. There's Prank Kits Roxy's. Uh, oh, I've never even seen this one. Cataclysmic Sorching Sunburner. Sick looking. Uh, Legendary Secret of the Six Samurai. Valkyrie Verte. Uh, Speed Burst Dragon. Got new Valkyrie cards. Xterra Tops, Orcus Nightmare, Subterra Guru, really good card. Clock Lizard, yeah, we finally got the Guru. It's a good ass monster. That's where they, the Japanese made that guy out of like background art or something. Isn't Subterra Guru in an old card? Are we getting another, or is it in a set? I don't know. Larry Secret of Six Samurai, TG Tank Grub, Solon Solemnity. Update Jammer and Fateful Hour. Target one monster that cannot be normal summoned or set in either graveyard. Special summon it. 
not bad. It's good for ABC. That's a good one. Cyber Synchron, Psychic Tracker, Clock Lizard, and Celerate Fox. Wasn't there? Yeah, there's Watch Cat, Watch Dog. I'm surprised there's not Watch Lizard. <laughs> Alright. Swordmaster, Orchestrated Release, Time Thief Redrew, and Super Anti Kaiju War Machine Mecha Thunder King. What a name. What a name. And Dark Factory of More Production. Oh, they changed its name. Over and Ostu is Mass Production. Wasn't it? No, nah, is that another card? Time Thief Regulator, Psychic Tracker, Cyber's Wicked, and Shirnui Squire Saga. It's so weird to see white cards again. Alright, let's take a look at this. Super Anti Kaiju War Machine Mecha Thunder King. My God, it's Mecha King Gadira. Crazy. A new Kaiju. Been a long time. During the main phase, if you can discard this card, banish one Kaiju monster that you, you control that is owned by your opponent, then you can special summon one monster from your graveyard. You can only control one Kaiju monster. This card is unaffected by other Kaiju cards' effects, and also going to be destroyed by battle with a Kaiju monster. During your end phase, if this card is in your graveyard, you can special summon this card. You can only use this effect of Super Anti Kaiju War Machine Mecha Thunder King once per duel. I was like, gonna say, like, my god, he just keeps coming back no matter what uh, during the end phase. But no, it's only once per duel. So he's on the uh, Gold Bulb and Black Wing Zephyr short list. It's a pretty short list at only once per duel. Uh, Swordmaster, what's the other one? Predator Plant, something. We're trying to release Time Thief for Duo, Shirnoi Sword Saga, Elemental Hero Cosmos Neos, Guard Dragon Shield, Edge of the Ring. My, what is this? Super Armored Robot Ar Arm Black Iron Sea? Holy crap. Subterra Secession. I swear Subterra Guru was on a card before this set. Like he's on another different. Subterra card. I'm going to have to look into that. I think he is. Surely Sword Saga, Guard Dragon Core Walking, TG Tank Grub, Guard Dragon Pisty. That's a terrible name. Guard Dragon Andrake Pisty. They couldn't think of a gr better name than that. Sound of Great Wolvie, Second Tracker, Super Armored Robot Arm, Black Iron Sea, and Red Rising Dragon. Yeah. Really hoping to pull, uh, I like to pull that Danger. Cataclysmic Scorching Sunburners, Shinobi Necro, that's a pretty cool looking card. Guardian Core Awakening, Shinobi Sword Saga, Sky Striker Ace Kaina, which is a pretty good card. A lot of people are down on this. This is probably the worst Sky Striker Ace card, but I still like it. Hyper Psychic Riser, uh, Cyrus Converter, Summon Over, and Subterror Guru. You know, it's a really hard card to pull. That's a short print common. I mean, it's super hardcore short print is uh, uh, Aloof Lupine. That card is hard to get. Neospace Connector. There it is right there on cue. Aloof Lupine. Cybers Integrator. Shurnui Squire. And Detonate Deleter. Cybers Wicked. TG Booster Raptor. Incantation Inception. Inception. Guard Dragon Promise. Remember that weird thing in Inception where it was like, boah. Blah. I was so tired of hearing that. That was when I was like into watching movies. So I'd go see the movie like once a month. I'd go to the movie theater once a month. And there'd always be a trailer for that. And I just got so tired of that noise. Time Thief's Beazle Ship. Catch Eve Level 2. Purple Clay Breaker. Sound Great Paro. TG Star Guardian. The Worst Ultra. And Cyber Synchron. Uh, Time Thief Winder. All these Time Thief cards look cool. TG Booster Raptor and Squirt Squid. It's like a uh, Inky or something from uh, Super Mario Bros. All right, one tuner plus one non-tuner TG monster. Once per change in your opponent's main phase, you can quick effect. Immediately after this effect resolves, synchro summon using this card you control. You can only use each effect of the following TG Guardian once per turn. If this card is special summoned, you can target one TG monster in your graveyard, add it to your hand. During your main phase, you can special summon one TG monster from your hand. Uh, interesting, I suppose. I don't think anyone's going to be playing TG anytime soon. TGs were really good back in the day when they first came out. 
like Extreme Victory or something. Time Thief Redoer, Shunery Swordmaster, Time Thief Bezel Ship, Thunderclap Monk, and Madolci Petiting Pet Pet Sasur? I don't know what that is. Uh, Red Rising Dragon, Cybers Converter, Shirnui Squire Saga, and Guard Dragon Justia. The fate of the world depends on the Guard Dragons born from the world legacy. I am not into the lore at all. Yeah. Alright. Update Jammer. I feel like they already made a card named that. Uh, Neo Space Connector, a Loop Lupine, Cybers Integrator, Guard Dragon Elpy, and Incantation Chalice Lime. I like the artwork on that one. I don't know why. Time Thief Hack. All these Time Thief cards are really interesting. Cybers Converter and Salmon Great Wolvie. Next week we have the Salmon Great Structure Deck, which I'm only buying to get the cheap $10 Ash Blossoms. That's about the whole reason. I just want to get those common Ash Blossoms. I just, I just want them. All right, Orchestrate Release, Time Thief Flyback, Unisong Tuning, Trickstar Band, Sweet Guitar, and World Legacy World Arc, Time Thief Winder, Edge of the Ring, Sound Great Foxer, and Subterra Succession. I don't know what this does. I have to read it. All right, left side of the box. Left side of the box. I'm a pretty good singer. Lost time. Each if your opponent life point is four thousand higher, your life point becomes one thousand left than theirs. You can only activate one lost time per turn. Why would you do that? I guess some card effects you want that like chicken game if it was still legal. Shirley Swordmaster, Formful Claybreaker, Summer Great Paro, World Legacy Guard Dragon. I heard people asking for this card at the YCS. TG Screw Serpent. Edge of the Ring, Summer Great Foxer, Sub Terror Successor. All right, let's go ahead and read this thing. I've never once read it. It's got a little bit of air there, a little white spot there. When this card is activated, you can target one level four lower dragon monster in your graveyard. Add to your hand or special summon it. Once per turn, you can target one dragon monster you control. Move to the monster zone you control to another of your main monster stones. You can only activate one world legacy guard dragon per turn. What is happening in this artwork? Is that the Crusadia Maximus guy? Is that that thing's name? So far, this box has been a little stinky. Neo Space Connector, Lost Time, Shirley sure, no, Swordmaster. Next, doesn't even look like a foil. Time Trickstar Fusion. Look, look at that. Look at the nose on Neo Spacean Grand Mole. Like, wow. I don't like that artwork. Time Thief Hack, Cybers Converter, Salmon Great Wolvie, and Shirley sure, no, Squire Saga. The Squire Saga. Guard Ring Garmedes. Wow, this is a mean looking monster. Cyrus Integrator, Child's Play. <laughs> That's pretty good artwork. Shirley Sword Saga, Elemental Hero Brave Neos. It barely looks different than Elemental Hero Neos. Guard Ring and Andrake. That's another mean looking one. Ex Terra Tops, Orcus Nightmare, and Sub Terra Guru. Got the place at a Guru in here. I almost got a place at a Lupine. <sighs> Just gotta get one more. I went up 25 packs from Sneak Peek and I didn't get one. Uh, Primal Claybreaker, Salmon Great Paro, Guard Ring Garmedes, TG Trident Launcher Secret Rare. There we go. Detonate Deleter, Cybers Wicked, Time Thief Regulator, Guard Ring Justia, and Surinui Style Success. I pulled the worst Ultra and I think the worst Secret out of this box. Uh, I also got two of these during Sneak Peek. If this card is linked summon, you can special summon one T one or three TG monsters from your hand, one from your deck, and one from your graveyard. Wow. In defense position to the your zones this card points to. It also you cannot special summon monsters for the rest of this turn except TG monsters. You can only use this effect of TG Trident Launcher once per turn. Your opponent cannot target TG Synchro Monsters this card points to with card effects. It's okay for TG. I mean I actually like it for TGs, but no, he's going to be playing TGs. Like, it ain't going to happen. Like, nobody seriously. Uh, Prank Kids Roxy, Sound Great Paro, Update Jammer, TG Tank Grub, and Sky Striker Ace Kayani, and Sound Great Violent Chimera. Oh, this is one of the, the cards Sound Great's going to use, right? 
I think that's their main boss monster. Maybe I'm wrong on that, but I do remember them playing it. Clock Lizard, Disgusting, Time Thief Hack. I'd love to read all these, but I know that this is going to be a long-ass video, and people are going to get angry. All right. Cyber's Integrator, Child's Play, which is, I guess they're making a remake of Child's Play. Shorty Sword Saga, Valkyrie Verte, Sound Great Sunlight Wolf. That's a good card. Orcus Nightmare, Psychic Tracker, Clock Lizard, and Sound and Great Foxer. Yeah, Sound and Great, I mean, a good side card against Sound and Great is that is the card in this set is the Fantastical Dragon, because they link summon a lot. Uh, Guard Ring Core Awakening, TG Tank Grub, Time Thief Beazle Ship, Shurinui Solemnity, and Shurinui Skill Saga Supremacy. I haven't seen this card at all. There's another Sound and Great Sunlight Wolf. Wolf. Cyber's Wicked, TG Booster, Raptor, Infantation, Inception. That's going to be cool about Salmon Great. This is going to be a really cheap deck to, for people to pick up. All right, this is a good looking card here. Uh, two plus zombie monsters. Single monster you control will not be destroyed by card effects. Fire monster you control cannot be destroyed by battle. Oh, look, this thing happens to be a fire monster. During your opponent's turn, quick effect, you can target one of your banished zombie synchro monsters. Special summon to a zone this card points to. You can only use this effect to surely skill Saga Supremacy once per turn. Huh, that's interesting. I do like the Shiranui's. I ain't gonna lie. I, I do like Shiranui's. They are pretty fucking sweet. I've played Shiranui many times online when they were brand new a couple years ago with Breakers of Shadow was their first set. Um, I played it quite a bit and it was pretty fun. I never played it in person, but I thought about it. Time Thief, Beazle Ship, Shiranui Style, Solemnity, Child's Play, Guard Dragon, Elpy, and Hita, the Fire Charmer Ablaze. Oh, we got a new Fire Charmer. Nice. Uh, guard Ring and Pro Man, this, I thought they were supposed to be friendly looking monsters. I guess not. Sound Great Foxer, Guard Ring Justia, and TG Booster Raptor. So I should be able to get another Ultra, I hope. One more Ultra. Maybe. Hopefully. I mean, we only got two more boxes over this one. Child's Play, Catch Eve, uh, Legendary Secret of Six Samurai, Prank Kids, Roxy, Shurinui Spectral Shade. Look at this thing. What is this? Nice. Fusion of Fire, uh, Guard Ring Prominesis, Red Rising Dragon, and Cyber's Converter. <coughs> Gotta get some beer here. <sighs> Tom Brady won his sixth Super Bowl. Still trying to figure out how it's possible one man can win that many Super Bowls. It's just unbelievable. Uh, Catch Eve Level 2, Literary Secret of the Six Samurai, Prank Kids, Roxy's Thunderclap Monk. And Guard Ring Cataclysm. Tribute 1 Dragon Monster. Target 2 cards on the field. Destroy them. You activate 1 Guard Ring Cataclysm per turn. That's a good card. That's like a um, a damn old uh, Fire Lake of the Burning Abyss. I like that. Except Fire Lake of the Burning Abyss was really weird. It required 2 Burning Abyss monsters. And then you could destroy 3 cards on the field. 3 Sparrow Traps. But it would... I, I don't know how Guard Dragons work. But that card could be nuts with Burning Abyss. All right, Shinobi Necro, Unisong Tuning, Time Thief Flyback, Neo Space Connector, Guard Dragon, Argapain, Rocket Synchro. I know I got another rocket monster in here. Uh, Shirinui Squire Saga, Guard Dragon, Justia, and Time Thief Winder. All right, last pack out of this box. I think there might be an Ultra in here. I can only hope. Don't let this be a bad box. Shinobi Necro, Unisong Tuning, Time Thief Flyback. It is a bad box, damn it! Shinobi Squire and Speed Burst Dragon. Only three Ultras? What the hell? I best rather get three Ultras than just one secret. Time Thief Winder, TG Booster Raptor, and Squirt Squid. It's a squirty squid. All right, on to box number two here. Are you tired yet? I'm a little bit winded. Ah. Oh. It's like halfway through this, I'm like, oh, I need a nap. I'm getting too old to be opening this many boxes. What am I doing with my life? All right, box dose. That is Spanish for two, for those of you who don't know. What's German for two? I can't remember. No. Fienf? Something, I remember. Fünf is something in German. 
I think like Octo or Otto or something is eight. I'm not sure. Catch Thief level two, formula clay breaker, salmon great parl update, jammer, final light. What is this? Oh, this is a Valkyrie support card. No wonder I haven't seen it. Cyber Secron, Sound Great Foxer, Edge of the Ring, and a uh, disgusting Armored Maxi. <laughs> All right, Fall Light. It's a pretty looking card. Uh, paying life points in multiples of a thousand. Hire one Valkyrie monster in your graveyard with a different name for every thousand life points paid. What? Special summon them when then your opponent can target special summon monsters with two thousand less attack from their graveyard. Up to the number of monsters that you special summon by this effect. What? Can I have one final light per turn? I don't understand that card at all. I'm just gonna leave it sitting there. I don't. I don't think I'm ever gonna play against Valkyries. I'm just gonna throw that out there right now. I just. Uh, Valkyries look so bad all the time. Uh, time Thief Redoer, Shurnoy Swordmaster, Time Thief Beasle Ship, Guard Dragon Pesty, Medulci Petting Sessor, another one of those nasty cards. Time Thief Hack, Shurnoy su Success Style, Style Success, Squirt Squid. The Squirt Squid. Ugh. Neo Space Connector, Aloof Lupine, Cybers Integrator, Time Thief Redoer, Guard Dragon LP. There's a lot of these Guard Dragons. Impactation, Chalice Slime, uh, Subterranean Succession, Cybers Wicked, and TG Booster Raptor. Folks, let me know what your favorite card of this set is. I think I already said mine is that Fantastical Dragon. I like the Trickstar Carobane. I like the Danger Ogopogo, Orchestrated Release, Time Thief Flyback, Unisong Tuning, another TG Trident Launcher. I think we know what secret's easiest to pull. That's my fourth one. World Legacy World Arc, Time Thief Regular. I like how this is like a, a silly looking horse. Like what is this supposed to be? Like a mechanical horse for a child? Psychic Tracker, Cyber's Wicked, and Shurnoe's Squire Saga. All right. Time to read the Trident Launcher again. Two plus effect monsters, including a TG Tuner. If this card is Link Summon, you can special summon one t three TG monsters from your hand, one from your hand, one from your deck, and one from your graveyard to defense position to the, your zones this card points to. Also, you cannot special summon monsters for the rest of this turn, except TG monsters. You can only use this effect of TG Trident Launcher once per turn. Your opponent cannot target TG Synchro monsters this card points to with card effects. So... I would assume you try to get a synchro monster out of the uh, out of the graveyard, a TG synchro monster, which I don't even remember what's the best TG synchro. Like I don't have a clue. I probably used to know. Shurnui Swordmaster, Time Thief Beazel Ship, Orchestrated Release, Time Thief Flyback, Shurnui Spectral Shade, and Lapis Dragon. Implantation Inception, Guard Dragon Prominences, and Red Rising Dragon. Red Rising Dragon. There's always some of those around. Like that Beach Boy song. Prank Kids Roxies. This is such cool artwork. Cataclysmic Scorching Sunburner. I like that artwork. Legend Dairy Secret of the Six Samurai. Thunderclap Monk. Speed Burst Dragon. Sound Great Wolvie. Psychic Tracker. Uh, Black Sea and Red Rising Dragon. Another Red Rising Dragon to finish that pack. All right. Prank Kids Roxy, Sound Great Parl, Update Jammer, TG Tank Grub, <laughs> Shiranui Skill Saga Supremacy. I'm getting duplicates of everything. Sound Great Sunlight Wolf, Sound Great Wolvie, Shiranui Squire Saga, and Cyber's Wicked. So we got here. <clears throat> Two plus zombie monsters. Synchro monster you control cannot be destroyed by card effects. Fire monster you control cannot be destroyed by battle during your opponent's Turn, quick effect. Carry one of your banished zombie synchro monsters, build something to the zone this card points to. You can only use this effect of Shurnui Skill Saga Supremacy once per turn. I think that's pretty decent. I, I, I Like I said, I like Shurnui. I've always been a fan. Alright. Still going strong. Still filling the magic. Shurnui Sword Saga, Time Thief Beazle Ship, Catch Eve, Neos Fusion. It's got that ugly dolphin. World Legacy World Arc. Are they running out of things for World? Red Rising Dragon, Cybers Converter, Shurnui Squire Saga, and Guard Dragon Justia. All right. Still doing the magic. Shurnui Style Solomonity, Guard Dragon Garmides, 
Neospace Connector, Cataclysmic Scorching Sunburner Valkyrie Verte, Summer Grade Violent Chimera, or Violet Chimera, I guess, Time Thief Regulator, Guard Dragon Justia, and Chernoe Style Success. You got a dress for success in Shiranui style. Uh, Pearl Claybreaker, Salmon Great Paro, Update Jammer, Elemental Hero Brave Neos, Dark Factory of Mass Production, Time Thief Winder, Edge of the Ring, Salmon Great Foxer, and Sub Terror Succession. Just ripping it up packs and. Hoping to get something good. Shinobi Necro, Guard Ring, Core Awakening, Shiranui Sword Saga, Time Thief, Beasel Ship, Fateful Hour. This is like a Shiranui card, isn't it? No, it's Shiranui and Mayakashi. Uh, Hyper Psychic Riser, Orcus Nightmare, Psychic Tracker, and Clock Lizard. Err. Alright, Neo Space Connector, Aloof Lupine, finally got a play set, took two boxes. Cypress Interrogator, uh, Element Hero Cosmos Neos, and Detonate Deleter. What is this thing? Oh, it's two Cypress monsters. Uh, Exteratops, Orcus Nightmare, Subterra Guru, and Clock Lizard. I think this Orcus Nightmare is not bad. I think it's a pretty decent card. Alright, other side of the box, left hand side. Trying to do what's right. Uh, Shinobi Necro, Unisong Tuning, Time Thief Flyback, Neo Space Connector, and another TG Star Guardian. All right, I'm really getting the duplicates here. Uh, Trickstar Fusion, Inter Incam Temptation Inception. Man, that is tough to say. Cybers Converter and Summon Over. That's the first one of these I've gotten. That must also be a short print. Uh, all right, TG Star Guarding. I pulled one of these for my entry packs at YCS Chicago as well. Once per chain during your opponent's main phase, you can quick effect immediately after this effect resolves. Synchro summon using this card you control. You can only use each of the following effects of TG Star Guardian once per turn. If this card is special summon, you can target one TG monster in your graveyard, add it to your hand. During your main phase, you can special summon one TG monster from your hand. TG! Yay! <laughs> All right. Sound great. Paro update. Jammer. TG tank grub. Shernui squire. Hita the fire charmer. Shernui style success. Orcus nightmare. Psychic tracker and clock lizard. All right. Still going strong. Lost time. Shernui sword master. Formal clay breaker. Sound great. Paro. Thunderclap, Monk, and Lapis Dragon. Almost like Lapras. Kind of looks like Lapras. Remember that Pokemon, Lapras? Right around it like a fairy. Subterra Guru, Time Thief Winder, and TG Boost Raptor. There's only one of those in the original game, wasn't it? Where was that at? Was that in the Ice Caves? Where Articuno was hiding? Articuno. Moltres and Zapdos. The first one you meet Zapdos, right? And Articuno, then Moltres. Shuri style Solomonity, Guard Ring, Garmides, Neospace Connector, Psychic Wheel Elder, Secret Rare. Never pulled that card before. Apple of Enlightenment. There's another Valkyrie card. Uh, Sound Great Foxer, Edge of the Ring, Super Armored Robot Armed Black Iron Sea, Sub Terror Succession. Sometimes I swear these try to make the name as long as possible. I mean, that's what, obviously with a Super Armored Anti Kaiju, that's what they tried to do. All right, if you control a level three monster other than Psychic Wigiller, you can special summon this card from your hand in defense position. That's actually pretty good. Huh. You can only special summon Psychic Wigiller once per turn this way. If this card is sent to the graveyard as Synchro Material, you can target one monster on the field with attack less than the Synchro monster that used this card's material destroy it. It only uses effect of Psychic Wheel Dealer once per turn. That's actually a pretty good card. I like that. That's good. I mean, it has play. Huh. My stack is about ready to fall over. Garden, Guard Dragon Garmides, <laughs> Cyrus Interrogator, Child's Play, Shirley Sword Saga, and Guard Dragon Elpy, Rocket Synchron, Squirt Squid, Time Thief Hack, and Cyber's Converter. So I should still get. How many here? One more Ultra, I'm hoping. 
Uh, Cataclysmic Scorching Sunburner Shinobi Necro Guard Dragon Core Walking Trickstar Band Sweet Guitar. That's a pretty cool looking monster actually. TG Screw Serpent. Cybers Wicked. TG Booster Raptor Incantation Inconception and Guard Dragon Prominences. You know what I'm having for dinner tonight? I want to have some toasted cheese sandwiches. I'm so stoked. Get that. They got Velveeta and Sharp Cheddar. Uh, I need to get through this box opening fast so I can. What's in this guy's mouth? Like a fish? I don't know. Shuri Swordsmaster, or say release, Time Thief Redoer, Shuri Sword Saga, World Legacy Guard Dragon. How many different altars have I pulled now? This is another duplicate. So I've only pulled one, two, one, two, three different altars in uh, two boxes. But I guess that makes sense because now they have short print ultras. Uh, Sound Great Wolvie, Psychic Tracker, and Big Ugly Bug. All right, we're going to see Guard Dragon. When this card is activated, you can target one level four or lower dragon monster in your graveyard. Add it to your hand or special summon it. Once per turn, you can target one dragon monster you control. Move it to that monster to you control to another of your main monster zones. You can only activate one World of State Guard Dragon per turn. It's not a bad card. I can see where it's going to be good. I mean, just being able to add or special summon any level four or lower dragon monster. That's got to be good. All right, so... Is that everything out of this box? I think that's everything. I think that's four altars, two secrets. Should be. Lost Time, Shirley Swordmaster, Permafall Claybreaker, Guard Dragon, Pisty. What a terrible name. Cyber Synchron. Summon Over, Sub Terror Guru, Time Thief Winder, and TG Booster Raptor. These packs are a little stuck together. That's weird. At sneak peek, I, I was actually able to pull two Boralode Savage Ring, whatever you call it. Guard Ring, Core Awakening, TG Tank Grub, Time Thief Beasel Ship, Shurnoy Soil Solemnity, and Guard Ring and Anger Pain. Fusion of Fire, that's for Salmon Great. Red Rising Dragon, Guard Ring Promnissus, and Salmon Great Foxer. What is happening in this artwork? It's like a fox, it's also a bug. I don't know what's happening there. All right, still going here. Sound Great Paro, Guard Ring Garmides, Cybers Interrogator, Serenity Spectral Shade, and Guard Ring Andrake. Guard Ring did good. Squirt Sword, Time Thief Hack, Cybers Converter, and Salmon Great Wolvie. You think Wolverine likes being called Wolvie? That's what it's supposed to be, right? Salmon Great Wolverine. Child's Play. What are the monsters in here? I gotta look this up and figure out if these are actual real monsters or not. Catch Eve, Legendary Secret of the Six Samurai, Frank Kids, Roxy's, Element Hero, Cosmos, Neos, and Incantation, Chala Slime. Uh, Guard Ring, Justia, TG Booster Raptor, and Orcus Nightmare. And then we got Child's Play, Sword Saga, Frank Kids, Roxy, Sky Striker, Ace, Kayana. And Guard Ring Cataclysm. Strange Sky Sire, Cyber's Wicked, Time Thief Regulator, and Guard Ring and Justia. All right, two boxes down. We're two thirds of the way. Two thirds, and I have pulled only three different Ultras so far. One, two, yeah, just three. And how many different secrets? One, two, three different secrets, but there's only eight secrets, so I'm doing a little better on that. Here we go, the final box. For great justice. Oh, there we go. Ah. Ah. Oh. All right, here we go, folks. Last box. The final countdown. Neo Space Connector. So weird to see as a common. So used to this as a super. Castle of the Scorching Sunburner, Shinobi, Necro, Guard Dragon, Core Awakening, Shuranui, Squire Saga, and Guard Dragon, Andrake. Sound Great Wolvie, Shuranui, Squire Saga, and Cyber's Wicked. Maybe I can pull a different Ultra. Maybe I can get like that Carabane or Ogopogo. Shuranui Style, Solid Entity, Update Jammer, Shuranui Swordmaster, next. And World Arc. Squire Saga, Cyrus Wicked, Time Thief Regulator, Guard Dragon, Justia. 
Arr. Yeah, there's a lot of decks at top. Shrinway Sword Slog, Good Time Thief, Beasel Ship, Catch Eve, Level 2 for all, Clay Breaker, Guard Dragon, Augur Pain, Apple Alignment. It didn't help that I only got three alls for that in one box. Time Thief, Regulator, Guard Dragon, Justia, and Shrinway Style of Success. What could be in this pack? Could it be another TG Trident Launcher? Or Shred Release, Time Thief Redoer, Shrinway Sword Saga, Thunderclap Monk, uh, Trickstar Fusion, Shrinway Style Success, Orcus Nightmare, Psychic Tracker, and Clock Lizard. I think this set's pretty good. I mean, there's always good cards in every set. I don't know what's good in Dark Neostorm yet. Um, I guess we'll wait and see. Sound Great Paro, Update Jammer, Neospace Connector, Aloof Lupine, and Trickstar Carl Bane. All right, that's a different Ultra Rare. And one of my favorite ones in this set. Hita the Fire Charmer of Blaze, Orcus Nightmare, Psychic Tracker, and Clock Lizard. I don't know why it took so long for us to get this card. I just, I don't understand. If you control no monsters, all monsters you control are Trickstar monsters, you can special summon this card from your hand. During the damage step, when your Trickstar monster battles an opponent's monster, quick effect, you can send this card from your hand to the graveyard. That monster gains, you control, gains attack equal to its original attack until the end of this turn. You can activate one Trickstar Carabane effect per turn and only once that turn. You can't do both. You gotta pick and choose. Both effects are great. Especially that honest effect. That's really good. Trust me, folks. It's really good in my testing. All right, pull a different ultra. There's hope. Guard Dragon Core Awakening, TG Tank Grub, Time Thief Beasel, uh, Elemental Hero Cosmos Neos, Dark Factory of More Production, Sound Great Foxer, Edge of the Ring, Super Armored. Oh, I'm not going to say the name. Sub Terrorist Succession. It tricks me every time. Like, no, that card's got way too long of a name and it's way too ugly of a card. All right, Clay Breaker, Solomon Great Paro, Guardian Garmidi, Cybers Interrogator, Surinui Spectral Sword Shade, Speed Burst Dragon, Impactation Inception, Cybers Converter, and Summon Over. All right. Surinui Swords Master, Time Thief, Beasel Ship, Orchestrate Release, Witch's Strike. That's a good secret rare. That's a nice one. Uh, Rocket Synchron, uh, TG Booster after Orcus Nightmare, Incantation Inception, and Cybers Converter. This card is really bizarre, but this thing's not even a counter trap. I thought it was, but it's not. If your opponent negates the normal or special summon of a monster's or the activation of a card effect, destroy your opponent's controls and destroy all cards your opponent controls and in their hand. That's brutal. But it's not a counter, so they still have a chance to respond. So I guess I guess if it was a counter, it'd be even... Like, imagine that as a counter. That card's weird. Like, it's really good, but at the same time, it's so conditional. Child's Play, Shirley Sword Saga, Prank Kids, Roxy, Sound Great Paro, Elm Great Hero, Brave Neos, TG Screw Serpent, Subterra Guru, Time Thief Winder, TG Booster Raptor, Time Thief Flyback, Unisong Tuning, Prank Kids Roxy's Fateful Hour, and Summon Great Sunlight Wolf. Summon Over, Subterra Guru, Time Thief Winder, and TG Booster Raptor. Booster Raptor. Update Jammer, TG Tank Grub, Shurnui Soil, Stalamenity, Gardering Garmides, and a Shurnui Skill Saga Supremacy. Uh, one in every box, folks. You gotta get one, I guess. Guard Ring Cataclysm. Squirt Squid, Time Thief Hack, and Cybers Converter. Yes, a full playset out of just three boxes. Well, you can tell this isn't hard to get. Uh, single monsters you control cannot be destroyed by card effects. Fire monsters you control cannot be destroyed by battle. During your bonus turn, quick effect, you can target one of your banished zombies. Single monster, special summon it to your zone. This card points to. You can only use this effect to share any skill saga supremacy once per turn. I wonder why you could summon it to your opponent's side of the field. Like, is there a reason for that? It has to be in defense mode, right? No, it doesn't. It can be in attack mode, too, so I guess you can attack it. Huh. I don't know why you'd do that, though, because it's only your opponent's turn, right? Uh, yeah, so I, that wouldn't be smart. I guess during your opponent's end phase. 
Cataclysmic Scorching Sunburner, Legendary Secret there of the Six Samurai TG Tank, whatever. Sky Striker Ace Kayani and Salmon Great Violet Chimera. Square Squid, Time Thief Hack, Cybers Converter, and Salmon Great Wolvie. Salmon Great is going to be like pe uh, Pepe. Cheap, almost free deck that's hella good. I expect to play against a lot of it coming up after next week. Everybody's going to be playing it. Time Thief, Beazle Ship, Shurney Style, Solemnity, Child's Play, Catch Eve, and Shurney Squire, and Trickstar Fusion. Psychic Tracker, Cybers Wicked, and Shurney Squire Saga. Time Thief, Beazle Ship, Catch Eve, Formal Claybreaker, Valkyrie Verte. Uh, Lapis Dragon, Squirt Squid, Time Thief Regulator, Psychic Tracker, and Cybers Wicked. Urgh. Still going here. Larry Seeker, the Six Samurai, Prankins, Roxy, Shinobi, Necro, Unisong, Tuning, and Guard Dragon, LP, Detonate, Deleter. Samurai Great Wolvie, Psychic Tracker, and Nasty Card. Alright, folks, we're almost there, I promise. It's not a bottomless box. We are almost at the end of this marathon. Sound great, Paro, Update, Jammer, Neospace, Connector, Trickstar, Band, Sweet Guitar, Fusion of Fire, Shirley, Squire, Saga, Sound great, Wolvie, Psychic Tracker, and Nasty. I hate when they print really ugly, long name cards. Ugh, such a waste of the time. All right. Time Thief Flybacks, Neo Space Connector, Loss of Time, Shirley Swordmaster, Final Light. Gotta get another one of those. Final Light. Heat of the Fire Charmer Ablaze. Uh, Red Rising Dragon, Gardering and Prominences. Salmon Great Foxer. Oh, I gotta read the Final Light. I still don't understand what this card is. This could be a chance for me to understand. Pay life points in multiples of a thousand target one Valkyrie monster in your grave with a different name for every one thousand life points paid. Okay, I get that. So some of them with then your opponents can special summon monsters with two thousand less attack from their graveyard up to the number of monsters you special summon by this effect. So why would you do that? It must be something to do with Valkyries. They must be able to attack everything or something. I don't know. Weird. Weird card is weird. All right, should be one more seeker and one more ultra. I'll, aloof Lupine, Cybers Integrator, Time Thief Reduro, Neos Fusion, Apple of Enlightenment. Red Rising Dragon, Guard Dragon, Prominences, Stalin Great Foxer, and Guard Dragon, Justia. Woo! Ugh, getting a workout. Brain Kids Roxy's Scorching Sunburner, No Seeker of the Sixth Samurai, TG Tank Grove, Shurnui, Spectral Sword Shade, Guard Dragon, Andrake, Exteratops, Orcus Nightmare, Subterror Guru. <laughs> Subterror Guru. I played against Subterror twice, and the first guy I beat, and he was so mad at Subterror, so he like immediately sold his deck. Update Jammer. TG Tank Grub. Serenity Style Solemnity. Pot of Extravagance! Alright, okay, okay. This box is pretty fucking good. Alright, okay. Dark Factory of More Production. Alright, okay, alright. Guard Ring Justia, Time Thief Winder, Edge of the Ring, and Salmon Great Foxer. Okay, alright. Okay, this is a good box. Alright, there we go. Here we are, pot of extravagance. At the start of your main phase, banish three or six random face down cards from your extra deck, extra deck face down. Draw one card for every three cards banished. For the rest of this turn, after this card resolves, you cannot draw any cards by card effects. This card is really good in Trickstar, <laughs> really good in Subterrors, really good in Altergeist. That card's nuts. Just can't draw anymore. You can still add from deck to hand, which is stupid, but I love it. Thunder Dragons can't play it. Sky Striker can't play it. I, Salmon Great can't play it. Shurnery Style Solemnity, Update Jammer, Shurnery Swordmaster, Upper Straight Release, Guard Dragon, Argapane, Rocket Synchron, Clock Lizard, uh, Nasty, Time Thief Hack. Still should get one more Ultra, I'm hoping. The first box. Only gave me three ultras. Ah, Guard Dragon, Garmedes, Neo Space Connector, Cataclysmic Sunburner, Guard Dragon, Pisty, 
Cyber Synchron, Subterror Succession, Exteratops, Orcus Nightmare, Subterror Guru. Alright. Time Thief Redoer, Shunami Sword Saga, Guard Ring, Core Awakening, TG Tank Grub, Trickstar Darvardis. Not the one I wanted, but still a Trickstar monster. It's actually pretty good. Sound Great Violent Chimera. Shunami Style Success, Squirt Squid, and Time Thief Regulator. Whoa. All right, let's go ahead and read the new Trickstar Link monster, which I actually like. Uh, two or two level three or lower Trickstar monsters. You can only control one Trickstar Devardis. Yeah, this card is special summon. Uh, you can inflict 200 damage to your opponent for no reason. If your opponent normal or special summons a monsters, inflict 200 damage to your opponent. That could be really good in some situations. I like this card. It's good. All right, last best hope. Can I get another ultra or secret rare out of this box to make up for the first box where I got gypped, I got robbed? Here we go. Shinobi Necro, Guard Dragon, Core Awakening, Shinobi Sword, Saga, no, Fateful Hour, and Guard Dragon Shield, finish off with the Clock Lizard, Nasty, Time Thief Hack, and Shinobi Style Success. All right, folks, there it is. That is the Marathon Complete. Three boxes. I am lathered in sweat. My back hurts. And I think I'm hungry. Um, anyways, guys, that was a long-ass video. The boxes were relatively poor, but I'm guessing since I did not get the Danger Monster, that's obviously short-printed again. They've always had Danger cards short-printed, and it makes sense that's the only Danger card. So, yeah, it's going to be short-printed. Uh, I think Borolot Savage Dragon short-printed is an Ultra Rare. That would leave, I think, one other Ultra to be short-printed. The sword print secrets are pot of whatever extravagance, uh, the the damn fantastic dragon, and uh, witch's strike. I think witch's strike is the other. So I think I got two of them. Wow, maybe I did. Huh? I don't know. I have to look into that. Anyways, overall, you know, thinks I just got that one pot of extravagance. That's a good ass time there. Um, really glad at first it started off looking real bad where I was getting the same ultras over and over and over again and even I got multiple secrets that one time uh, really sad I only got three ultras out of that one box what can you do um, anyways guys thanks for watching if you like what you saw give me a, go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you want to see more of this hit that, hit that subscribe button if you want to be notified instantaneously the main man's back at it again He's getting drunk, he's getting hungry, he's getting sweaty. Uh, hit that bell icon for whom the bell tolls me to notify instantaneously that I'm doing it once more. Uh, and I really appreciate every comment, like, and view that I get. Tickles my, tickles my heart, makes me feel like I'm doing something right. And anyways guys, sorry for the late upload. I'm gonna try and upload. I always say this all the damn time. I know I say it all the damn time. I really apologize, but I'm so busy. Life is so hectic. Uh, it doesn't help that mother nature is just bombarding me. I had a cold last week. It's just damn. Getting old sucks. I'm not even old yet. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. And I will catch you guys hopefully in a couple of days. Peace!